Hey there, welcome to video number five of types of chemical reactions. So this uh, video is going to focus on combustion reactions that are complete. So a combustion reaction always involves, or most usually involves, a organic compound that contains carbon and hydrogens, and it needs to react with oxygen, and this should be gas. Let's change that. Alright, so in the case of methane, we have four carbons and, or one carbon, four hydrogens, and two oxygens. And we know that combustion reactions always create CO2 gas and water. So when you start your car, it's going to burn gas, which is an organic compound. And if you look out your tailpipe, it's actually releasing carbon dioxide gas and hydrogen or um, and uh, vapor water in usually the gas form. So that's what you're actually seeing. This is what's happening in your combustion engine in your car. So we need to balance this. Um, let's balance the H's first. So I can see here I have four hydrogens. So I need to double this molecule to get four hydrogens. And now I can see on this side I have two oxygens here and I have two oxygens here. So I need to have four oxygens on the other side. So I'm gonna double this as well. And that's our balanced combustion reaction. So now our next one is this molecule here. And it's also an organic compound reacting with oxygen. So we know this is going to be a combustion reaction. Combustion reactions always create CO2 and water. And they usually always um, create heat as well. So always remember that. Now on this side we have, it looks like, six oxygen here and six oxygen here so that must be a total of 12 so let's add six here and let's add six here I'm sorry I lied to you there's a total of 18 so this molecule right here has 12 by itself 12 oxygen and this molecule has six so that's 18 altogether and then here we have um, as well 12 oxygen and here we have 6 oxygen so that's perfect we have 18 on both sides and let's look at the hydrogens to see if they're balanced well here I have 12 hydrogens and it looks like here I have 12 hydrogens as well so this is a balanced reaction so whenever you are looking for a combustion reaction always remember that you need to start with an organic compound it's always going to react with oxygen to create carbon dioxide and H2O vapor. Now this is a complete combustion reaction. If you want to learn about incomplete combustion reactions, look at the next video. Thanks guys.